guys, it's Lawrence Cruise World. Today I would like to show you this absolute time capsule from Australia. It's a Toyota Land Cruiser HJ61. It was sold in Australia, Western Australia, in 1986. It had been from a gold miner who owned it for four years, but he had gone broke and then the previous owner bought it. He owned it for 27 years and took it with him to the UK and that's where we bought it on one of our recent road trips. Um, like I said, Australian version, of course you can see it because of this immaculate bull bar in Australia, an absolute must have here in Europe. It's not allowed on the roads. So Toyota produced these Land Cruisers for different markets in different countries around the world. This is a typical Australian Land Cruiser with all typical Australian features that we don't get in Europe. So let me walk you through it. The standard factory flares, we did get those in, in Europe as well, but it's always cool to see one on a high roof. I think it's a really cool feature. Running boards, original Toyota, we also get those in, in Europe. These decals, we did get decals in Europe, but not these ones. I think it's particularly cool also with the Eagle. The rust, we do get the rust in Europe as well. It's not typical Australian. It is in the typical 60 series spots, doors, and of course the quarter panel is very prone to rust. It is a high roof, standard roof that will finish here. High roof is a little bit higher. You see the sliding window because it has a third row seats. We'll get to that when we get inside. Sliding windows for the passengers on the third row seats. Here you have the foldable seats. You can take extra passenger with you. You can fold them down like this. Over that side another one. Very cool feature indeed. Third row passenger air conditioning. We don't get this one in Europe. We do get the third row seats, but we don't get it with the air conditioning. Very cool. Of course, here you have another piece of the air conditioning unit. As you can see, here's the air conditioning for the second row seats. Uh, it's a very cool feature. We don't get this in, in Europe at all. And this is a typical high roof feature from Australia. As you can see, it's a right hand drive. Of course, we don't get this in mainland Europe, right hand drive. Also these little gauges, we don't get these ones as well in Europe, it's typical Australian. You have uh, the little clock here and of course the dash grab handle, we don't get that on the high roof versions as well in Europe. So this is all pretty cool. Ah, gotta love those 12 HT engines. Listen to this sound, guys. Very nice, very nice. Well, let's take her for a spin, the old girl. So thank you guys for watching, if you like this video give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our YouTube channel. See you next time!